Darcy's here, and Maddie with Backwoods Mindset. We're hanging out here. I actually have one of my uh, MT Homestead shirts on today. We're also out here with little Paisley, who's chewing her tail. Hey, Paisley, look up here. No? Okay. Anyways. Uh, so, one of my subscribers messaged me and said, I have a tortoise. And my tortoise absolutely loves Rosa Sharon flowers. We got a good handful on here. So we, Darcy and I, are going to pick some of these and we're going to send it to them. Um, in, they're in uh, North Carolina. Um, so we're going to do that. Uh, we're going to get these picked up. You guys are going to see that. Oh, look, there's a little bumblebee. A little bumblebee in there. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, it's on the flower. Anyways, uh, we're going to pick some of these and uh, we're going to sh ship them out to them tomorrow. So um, she actually offered to pay, which I'm not, I don't want anything for it. I'm sending them, I'm not charging for them. Um, I'm going to send them. Um, that way, this tortoise can have a neat little snack. Um, and I asked her to pay it forward. Um, I thought that'd be cool. I said, if you want to do something nice, donate it. Somebody needs help, help them out if you will, whatever you wanted to do for it. So we're going to do that. But Darcy and I are going to get picking some uh, flowers here. We're going to get a good, a good amount so that we can ship them. I don't know how to do this. I've never shipped flowers before. I, I guess I'm going to put them in uh, like one of those sealed things, maybe inside a Ziploc bag or something. What do you think, Darcy? I, I don't I don't know I didn't I didn't even know tortoises liked them but she said when she was in Georgia she found out that her tortoise liked them um, and I actually I think she has a channel too I'm going to uh, if I can find it I think she sent it to me there is a video of her tortoise which I think is awesome I've never known anybody that has had a tortoise before so we're gonna get to picking these and we'll be back here in a minute. So we're getting a pretty good haul right now. Darcy kind of took over doing it. Um, and we're going to send, you know, as much as we can. I don't know how many to send either. I guess I can always send more. And I'll show you. So we're picking these. But as you can see, our bushes are all, they're all hanging over. Look at all the buds on these. You can see all of them. They're all over this. So it doesn't matter. Yeah, go ahead and get those ones, stars. So we're just going to send as many as we can because we know more are going to be coming out. So... But we got to show you in the bag here. What do we got? It doesn't look like a whole lot, but there is, there's quite a bit in there. So, and then you can see my horrible fire pit that's just shot. I need to throw that sucker out. I need to get a new one. But yeah, these are going to be blooming back up. We'll get more. And if she wants more, I'm always happy to make a tortoise happy. You too, right, Dars? Next, I think we're gonna, after we get done doing this, we'll get some more here. Um, I guess, I'm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna do like a Ziploc bag. And then, see, they're just, I mean, they're all over this thing. Got my boy, Ringo, over here. Hey, Ringo, say hi, everybody. Hey, 
We got spit all over your face. Anyways, we're going up here to take a look at our at our tomatoes, which seems like it's pretty much the only thing that's kind of growing decently. We got a couple out here. A couple. You want to try one, Dars? Sure. There you go. Darcy's trying the first one. What do you think? Tastes like a tomato. Oh, there you go. It tastes like a tomato, so we know that's a winner. I want to try one here too. Let's see. See how it how it tastes up part of it. They're pretty good. We've got a couple cucumbers down there. Maybe we, you want to go grab a cucumber, Dars? That one? The only one that looks like it's right? That green one back over there? I don't know if the people can even see that. It's right over there. And Darcy's going to grab that. And we'll see here that these two guys, well, lady and boy, just hanging out out here. So we'll see what Darcy, she's over here picking the first cucumber. Well, there's only two over there, and the one looks like garbage. Twist it. Okay. So we got this big cucumber here. It's huge. Um, yeah, it's a cucumber though. That's the first one. Actually, it looks like when she lifted it up, it actually looked like there's some other ones that are sprouting over there. So that gives me a little bit of hope. But we'll see what the rest of the rest of the vegetables do here um let me get this cleaned up and give it a little give it a little bite see what see what we got going on what do you think dars hmm. yeah. it's a little spiky. it is a little spiky it's got some little spikes on it is this burpless or does it have all the burps i think it's burpless you think so she thinks it's burpless i it might have all the burps though we don't know yet but i think we're gonna get a knife out here maybe try to take a little oh paisley wants to see the cucumber she says damn that looks delicious <laughs> anyways we're gonna get a knife here and i think we might cut it and see how the cucumber tastes do you want to do that all right darcy's gonna go grab a knife or you know what i think well, no i don't have my pocket knife on me darcy's gonna grab a knife and we'll be back here in a minute and we're gonna do knife safety right darcy be real careful so we'll be back here in a minute okay so Darcy brought me out a little knife here so I can cut this up here Let's see here get a little little slice for Darso come over here here hold that I'm gonna we're gonna try it at the same time it's juicy you can see all the it smells good right That's a good cucumber. I mean, it's really good. Oh, mm, it's delicious. Mm. Come here, boy. Ringo wants to try a piece, too. Oh, now Paisley's jealous. We gotta give Paisley a piece. Paisley, do you want a piece? Oh, my girl wants a piece. Is that good? No, oh, yeah, so this is, this is an amazing amazing cucumber i wish i would have looked into it some more you can see Ooh. that's a good cucumber we want another piece stars here i'll split this a little bit here for the dogs give it to them but anyways yeah that's a good did you just burp that was gross there you go. Anyways, I think I'm gonna go for a little drive here for a minute, go down, maybe we'll talk for a minute and uh, we'll get on with this video. Got some things I wanna talk about. So we'll be back here in a minute and who knows where I'm gonna go, but I'll be right back.
So that was extremely satisfying having a cucumber that I kind of grew. I mean, I, you know, I watered them. Mrs. Backwoods watered them. The kids watered them. We put them in the ground. But it was exciting. I wish I would have had more. There's a flare truck. Um, I wish I would have planted maybe earlier. It was a weird year, though, so I don't know. Anyways, I'm just taking a run down here. Uh, we're going to go down. I haven't checked out the fishing spot in a while. It's a different one. I'm going to go see if I can take a look at it before it gets too dark. And uh, it's been a minute since I've been down there. Just kind of want to go see how it looks. See if it might somebody might be down there that I can ask how the fishing's been and we'll be back here. Hey everybody, so I just got down here, oops, and I just dropped my wallet, that's not good, but anyways, I just got down here to the river, and I'm going to go take a look, um, see what the river looks like, so you guys are going to go over there with me, we'll take a look and see how it's looking today. So I don't know how well the lighting is down here. I'm trying to get in some more light, but you can see the water pretty calm. Um, not much movement. See all the geese over there and the lights. I headed down a little late tonight um, to take a look. It was a last minute thing that I decided to try to do. Um, Aiden had his first like real day of going and doing two high school classes like I've said before he's in eighth grade and um, he was chosen him and one other uh, his best friend were chosen because they're both smart kids to do two high school classes um, so I'm really just proud of him I'm excited for him um, I'm really proud of Darcy too Darcy's an excellent student but she uh, she starts tomorrow and then Aiden will go back to his grade school tomorrow um, after he gets done with the uh, with the high school classes. So he gets picked up and then he gets taken back there. But it's a lot to take in. My kids are getting older. Um, I love them to death. You know, as they get older, I keep forgetting how much older they're getting. And I don't know, it makes you a little sad sometimes. I liked when they were little, you know. But they're growing up, and I'm proud of them, and they're turning out to be really good kids, so that makes it even better. But what I was getting to was the reason that I really want to get this property, and it's not even so much for me, it's for my family. Um, I want to get property. I want to be able to have something that we can have fun as a family on. Um, I want to have something extra, so if the kids want to build something, and live there they can um, I don't think there's anything that I'd like more moving forward in my life is that when my kids are adults that they live close to me or they live on the same property um, that's something that's really important to me and that's why I know I got to bust my butt I know I got to work harder and I got to get things done so that I can do that um, for my fam family because I love Mrs. Backwoods and Aiden and Darcy more than anything so I uh, just got to keep hustling 
Um, I got to stay positive and keep it going. Can't let myself get down. Sometimes I just like coming here and doing some thinking. I figured that I would finish up the video here. Uh, so um, I want to thank Kristen from North Carolina for emailing me about her tortoise having the obsession with Rosa Sharon flowers. Um, so we're sending those out. And thank you, Kristen, for um, subscribing and being a, a member in this community of amazing, amazing subscribers. So I love you all. Slime on. See you on the next one. Bye, everybody.